Hello, thank you for joining me and as this is my first video upload of 2021, Happy New Year. Now the reason I'm posting today is because I want to go through the process of showing you how I'm going to make a photograph and enter it into Mike Brown's photo competition on the theme of taking pictures in the dark. Quite a challenge because in the greater Tokyo area, like many other places such as the UK, we're just entering lockdown again. So I don't really want to stray too far from home. So I'm going to embrace that part of the challenge and take a photo not three feet away from my front door. I live in an apartment in a public housing project in the southern suburbs of Yokohama. And I'm just going to stand my camera on a tripod, face it outwards and take a picture of an urban scene in the early evening. It is going to be quite a challenge because the camera I own is a Pentax Q. Solid little camera but with a tiny sensor, not a great performer in low light. Look at the size of it compared to my other electronic equipment, the video camera, the lens that I'm going to attach to it and even an apple But, I'm going to counter that by using my noggin, taking pressure off the sensor, even though I'm not intending to raise the ISO from base, I'm going to stretch the exposure out, because it's going to be a still shot after all. OK, I'll keep an eye on the situation here, to the north, which is where I want to take the picture, make sure it doesn't go too dark before I set my camera gear up. What I want to do really is kind of get something in the frame along the lines of this blue blue the hour is blue i have a lovely little pentax q but the sensor inside is a very small size so i need to improvise so 10 second exposure at about 70 millimeters, which is a full frame equivalent, I'm guessing, of about about 350. Not as uh, far as I thought I needed to go, actually. And you can see the photo if you follow the link below. a lovely little pentax cube but the sensor inside is a very small size so I need to improvise good luck everyone stay safe 